Father O'Brien here for another episode of Bridging the Distance, a way for you to remain connected to Santa Clara as we are sheltering at home and dispersed around the world. Today, we have one of our favorite professors here at Santa Clara, Aliyah Griffin. Aliyah uh, uh, teaches in the Ethnic Studies Department. Welcome, Aliyah. Thank you so much for having me. Well, I, you not only teach here, but you were a student here. Mm -hmm, that's right. So what was it like to be an undergrad at Santa Clara? Uh, I loved my classes. I loved my professors. I um, really enjoyed being close to home as well. I was an English major, but I took a lot of my classes in the theater department, the classes that Cross listed. And it's been a phenomenal experience to return to campus and be able to teach some of those classes myself. So what do you see? What's the same? What's different? Um, the campus has transformed a lot. Uh, when I was a student here, the library was completely different. We didn't have that gorgeous, stunning building that we have now. So I try to encourage my students to really take advantage of the beautiful spots on campus. Um, it's been amazing to see, even in the six years that I've been here, to see the campus continue to grow um, and evolve. Great. But I, as I would say, we, we do have one of the most beautiful campuses, but it's the people that make the difference, right? Mm -hmm. um, and so I know you're back here because you love teaching. Uh, what's it like to teach in a virtual environment? You're teaching currently Intro to African American Studies, right? Yeah, like many uh, faculty and students, I didn't know what to expect when I started the quarter, but I was committed to having a student-centered classroom and I wanted to really teach and lead with compassion and flexibility. It was important to me to meet the students where they are and to really listen to what their needs were. Um, and I've been so impressed with our students. Our students are so wonderful and amazing. And to see the way that they've connected and reached out to each other during this time has been um, inspiring as well. And what, what do you miss most about uh, this environment of, uh, of online and remote learning? So I definitely miss our hallway. Um, my, ha my office is located on the first floor of St. Joseph's. And so as a former English major, it's exciting because the English department is on floor two and three. So I get to see um, some of my friends from the English department come down as they're, they're walking to class. But our particular hallway is half ethnic studies, half women and gender studies. And so uh, being able to be in the hallway and see our students um, and see my wonderful colleagues in both of those departments is something that I really, really miss. I especially miss um, seeing Pauline, who is in our office of, um, for the Department of Ethnic Studies, and also the students who work in that office. Um, I really miss seeing them every day. Yeah, no, I think all of us are experiencing, although we're connecting virtually, we, I think we just miss being in the physical yeah. presence of other folks. So, and I know we look forward to the day where we all can, can be together again. So as we conclude, how about sending a message to all of our Santa Clara students? So the message that I would want to send is uh, that, you know, in person, we say that our door is always open and it is true online as well. Reach out to us. We're here for you. We are a community and we'll take it day by day, um, but please reach out if you need anything and I know that your other professors feel the same way. That's great. Well, at, at a Jesuit university, we talk a, a lot about core personalis, caring for each person in mind, body, and spirit in their uniqueness, and Aaliyah embodies that uh, in so many ways. So, so happy to talk to you, Aaliyah, and uh, uh, thanks to everyone for joining us on this episode. We'll see you next time, and until then, um, take care and God bless.